Hey guys, what's up? Vril here. So this is last week's spread, which I realize is fandom, and this week my spread is also fandomy. But that's okay, so we're planning for the 14th through the 20th, and I'm so excited for this kit. It is the Sailor Moon kit from Simply a Mess. I've never ordered from this shop before, but overall I was really, really happy with this kit, and really happy with it ends up how it ends up turning out. Uh, spoiler warning, I guess. Uh, but yeah, I just, I really wanted a Sailor Moon kit with this artwork, so I think it's really pretty, and I really liked hers the best, so that's why I ended up getting it. And yeah, you can see part of my desk slash dining table, because I'm filming this on the dining table, and I just realized you can totally see the text through from the other side, because I used, I didn't use like the big gradient boxes, I used the smaller ones, but you know, whatever, that's okay. But anyway, <laughs> I zoom in eventually, so you can't really tell too much, um, but you know, whatever. So we put this one in the corner, which says Fighting Evil by Moonlight, which is from the theme song. This entire time I was planning this, I was basically humming the theme song to myself. Um, I was a huge Sailor Moon fan as a child, 7th and 8th grade, which here is junior high. I would come home from school and I would watch Sailor Moon and then I would watch Dragon Ball Z. Total anime nerd, um, loved anime growing up, still watch it sometimes. Uh, so yeah, so I really wanted to do a Sailor Moon thing because I thought Sailor Moon was awesome. She was basically me, she was cool, she fought crime, she saved the world, she had a talking cat, she had some cool friends, she liked food, like I, I thought she was great. <laughs> so yeah, so I really wanted to do a Sailor Moon kit, so yeah. Here we go. So the way I decided to do these full boxes is I tried to do Sailor Moon specifically on the side. So like Sailor Moon and then the compact and then her cat Luna, which I've always wanted to get a cat, a black cat, adopt a black cat and name it Luna and then get a white one and name it Artemis. Those are the two cats from the series in case you're curious. And then here I'm putting down the littles and I actually decided to do these checkbox things again because I really liked them last week so I wanted to try them again this week So I originally bought glitter headers for this kit but I wanted to do do actual headers this time, so again, I guess rather. And I really like this washi too, so I did one side, and then now I am basically doing the other side. So some news, I might be moving here in a couple of months, and when I do so, I'm going to get a dedicated desk to planning. It also might be like my vanity slash like where I put my makeup on, because right now I literally just put my makeup on in my bed, I sit in my bed, and I use this uh, laptop tray thing that I have to put my mirror on and I put my makeup on and like that's it. But I would like to have a dedicated space for certain things. And my current desk has a lot on it in terms of equipment because it has all my gaming stuff. So it's really difficult for me to plan videos here anymore because of the way it's set up. So I thought getting just like a small corner desk in my room, in my new room I guess rather, would be really nice. So I'm excited for that. Uh, so that'll be really cool. Definitely gonna be going to Ikea, which I've never been to Ikea, um, but I've heard great things about it. We had one open here in Florida, uh, I think like a year ago, last year? Um, I think it's still pretty new, but I'm excited. Definitely gonna be going to Ikea to get some furniture. I'll probably still use the same desk that I have for my main desk, but I don't know, we'll see. Anywho, putting all of the full boxes down, so I split up the some of the Sailor Moon girls um, and actually, for those that were a fan of Sailor Moon and you watch the anime, uh, the US version changed a lot because <laughs> a lot of it um, they felt was inappropriate for children. And when I grew up and I watched, and I, you know, like internet was a thing, so like I could look up like the originals. Um, so I always thought that was funny that they changed a lot of stuff, which it wasn't really anything that was bad. There is, um, I know in the original US version, there's like two girls that are supposed to be cousins, but in the original, they're actually girlfriend. Girlfriend and girlfriend. And I always thought that was funny. Because my friend used to watch the original, so I always knew that they changed that, and I thought it was funny. Anyway, <laughs> a little factoid there for you. Here I'm putting up the date covers. At some point, I'm going to cover up these flags in the corner with some of the washi that came with the kit. I just didn't have any scissors or my little X-Acto knife that I like to use uh, for planning. Um, so I didn't end up doing that. And then here I'm putting a half box and then like these quarter boxes and alternating because it doesn't come with a full set of half or quarter because I did get this in like the mini kit, I think, or the smaller one. I don't remember what she calls it in her thing, but 
you know, whatever. Um, so yeah, I did that and kind of alternated. And then here I'm looking at TV shows. This is not sponsored. I'm just, it's just the app that I use TV show time to figure out what shows are on this week because I forgot to check beforehand. And then my camera ran out of space, so it didn't get all of that in there, but I basically just filled stuff out. And then I'm going to cover them with some stickers here in a second. And I am doing an EC unboxing on Wednesday. That is the planner that I got. So if you subscribe, you will see it on Wednesday and hit that notification bell or whatever you're supposed to say now. Um, and then I also have a gaming mouse unboxing on my main channel. And then that film sticker is from uh, Scribble Prince Co. And I'm just putting that on the side because I'm going to be house sitting for one person for a week and, and watching their puppy and their dog. And then another lady and her husband, I'm house sitting for them for three weeks because they're going to Europe. So I want to pre-film a lot of videos for my main channel because, you know, I have my, my usual setup and it's a little bit easier. And then this YouTube sticker is from Let's Lumos. I don't think she has it in the shop anymore, although I think she's on vacation right now anyway, so I guess it doesn't really matter. And then the shopping sticker is from a shop that doesn't exist anymore. I actually put it on the wrong day. I'm buying Black Panther on Blu-ray on Tuesday because I want to see that movie and I didn't see it before I saw Infinity Wars. And I really want to see it, so I'm going to buy it when it comes out. <laughs> and so I just covered up with a Starbucks run sticker uh, from Planning Roses, because I'm sure I'll probably go to Starbucks this week since I still have money on my gift card, and we're going to vacuum. And then I'm just going through the stickers to figure out what I need to still put down and what I have room for. Laundry sticker is from Planning Roses as well. I'm going to finish up my laundry. And then we're going to be streaming on Monday and Tuesday, and I will be streaming when I'm house sitting, but it'll obviously be a different setup than what, you know, I normally have. And then Wednesday, I start dog sitting, and that little cute little dog bowl, cat bowl thing is from uh, Fox and Cactus, and I think it's really cute. And here I'm filling out kind of my filming list, because I want to, since I'll be gone for basically a month, I want to have at least one to two videos a week for the main channel, and have those all just like ready to go and maybe uploaded. Then I'm going to work on the blog a little bit on Thursday when I'm dog sitting, and that is from Dizzy Days of Dreams. The clock sticker is from Thumbprints Co., which doesn't exist anymore. Um, and I'm kind of just going through and figuring out what else I wanted to put. And then the Instagram sticker from Dizzy Daisy Dreams as well, which they didn't really fit, which is why I kind of spaced them in between. Um, so I probably should have spaced them a little bit more, or maybe just not even use the half boxes. Or maybe put the half boxes on the bottom. I don't know. It made sense to me at the time, but you know, whatever. But that is my plan with me. Obviously I'll fill stuff out as the week goes on, but those are kind of the first days that I know of what I'm doing. So thanks so much for watching this video. I really, really love this kit. I'm definitely going to be purchasing from her shop again. I'm really happy with how it turned out. The stickers were cut beautifully. The stickers look beautiful. Super, super happy with it. We'll be purchasing from again 10 out of 10, but be sure to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. I'll be uploading Playing With Me videos every Monday, so don't forget to subscribe. We also have our Erin Condren unboxing video on Wednesday, so I will see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye!